everyone, Miss here. Thanks for stopping by. So today I thought I would show you my bargains. Wow. Okay, so um, most of them have come from Amazon. In fact, I think have all of them come from Amazon. Yes, I think all of them have come via Amazon from different companies. Um, I have used my Vipon code. It's my coupons with some of them. Uh, we'll look at that one last because that one's still wrapped up. Um, we'll have a look at the ones that are actually out of packages because they came in boxes with other things. Now, these are the pick-me-up pens, uh, the silhouette uh, pick-me-up pens that I use mainly all the time now for diamond painting. Um, although in this hot weather, I am going back to using um, normal diamond painting pens, the acrylic pens, uh, because I'm finding that the... Uh, it's like blue tack that you get in the end is very, very sticky. Um, I will probably do a different video um, showing you this. It is a different way of um, picking up. It's basically like blue tack or museum putty that's in the end. Um, but you have to just use a very, very small amount. So it's just very, very tacky. Otherwise, particularly if you're using um, a double-sided tape canvas it can stick to your canvas really easily and then it's very difficult to get off but that was my first little bargain uh, that came from green print I, I do believe let me find me uh... oops yeah the green stick materials there look if you can see that Oops, yeah, green stick materials is where this came from. Um, oh, and they're in Bridlington, so they're actually quite near me, I didn't realise. Um, but yeah, they do all sorts of um, different things for your cameos, your silhouettes, um, your brother scan and cuts, your cricket machines. They do all those sort of things. So they do do the silhouette pick-me-up pens, and I got this one on special. I do believe I paid about £9.45 for this, which was a really, really good price. But if you want to see it, um, I have done, I think with one of my Whip and Chats, I did use it. Um, but I will do a separate video. Let me know in the comments down below if you want to see a bit more about that. But that's my first little purchase I got. I like to stock up on those if they are uh, on special offer. Um, I then got my basic, which is a washi tape in all these lovely colours and these were reduced with the coupon they're normally 5 99 for the set and I got them for 2 99 and that's because I am an Amazon Prime member so when I use the coupons I do get uh, free postage and it's next day delivery so we've got a lovely uh, washi tape there that's like got little squares on it <laughs> actually could diamond paint on that they're probably about the size of the squares of your squares, if you see what I mean. <laughs> um, and then we've got sort of like peaches, pinks, going through to green, blue, another peach and then a yellow at the end. Let's just see how much is on each one. They're not the bigger rolls than they look, actually. They're quite, uh, yeah, there's not a great, I mean, there's enough because washi tape obviously is quite thin. But as you can see, it's got a big roll in the middle. Um and not a huge amount of tape around the rolls there but for 2 99 I think that's a bargain I will put links for everything that I've got down below and I thought they're just nice um, I do well at the moment I haven't put uh, any mounting on pictures that I've uh, put into frames but I may do with those and I do use them for other crafts and things that I do as well so that's those Right, and then, oh, the next one, sorry, is from AliExpress. Um, and you'll probably laugh when you see these, because as if I really need more of these. Just check there's nothing else in that bag, no. So, yeah, just move that out of the way a second. Uh, yeah, I've treated myself to some tweezers. <laughs> I do have an awful lot of tweezers that come in with their kits. But I just saw these rainbow ones and I do have some rainbow scissors. So I just had to get myself some like iridescent rainbow. Now they're the really, really pointy tweezers and they've got a very, very long sharp point on them though. So I have to be very, very careful with those. And then some long pointy curved tweezers. So you can see they're, they're curved. 
and they were as I say from AliExpress and I paid $2.75 so probably just over £2 with free postage for those as I say I probably need new tweezers like um, I need a chocolate teapot but uh, I just couldn't resist I just loved the colours rainbows so yeah you uh, may see those but yeah, it was just one of those late night purchases where you're looking through and you think, what can I get? They are a good heavy, solid one, actually. They're not brilliantly finished off at the end. I mean, for the price, gosh, about a pound each, what can you expect? But yeah, they're uh, certainly a good, strong one. Let me see, can you pick stuff up? Yeah, they're going to pick up. Um, yeah, nice and pointy at the end. We've stabbed that, so yeah, I will probably use them. Uh, keep the ends on them though. The curved ones could be quite useful as well for just um, straightening up drills, moving drills around. So that's another little purchase that I've got. <laughs> I don't really need. Let's put them back in the case. And that's strange. It opens at that end. It hangs at that end and it's opened at that end. How strange. I wonder if there was something else in this packet and they've just used that packet for shipping. Quite possibly, because if you hang it up, they're all going to drop out. <laughs> Put those over there. Now then, this one, as you know, my eyesight isn't brilliant. So this is a hands-free magnifying glass. And it would normally have been £16.98. And I got this for £5.94. So for just under £6, again, um, Amazon Prime, free shipping, uh, Vipon code and this is from the live high top dash eu store uh, again i'll put all the links down below so i thought it was worth having a look um and see if it'll work it might help me actually while i'm doing kitting up and kitting down because i'll be able to uh, have a look i've just knocked those on the floor i'll be able to look at numbers and things possibly better so let's have a look the set um, and other things so oh not taking it out of the pack, looks like we've got a few extra bits of this as well. So, we've got a nice cleaning cloth there. It's a USB, so we've got a little USB there. What's this then? Oh, look! Oh, wow! Oh, that's going to be great for kitting up and kitting down. We've got a magnifying glass. Yay! So, let's see. Oh, yeah, I don't know whether you can uh, see that. Yep. Oh. Yeah, we've got a magnifying glass so we can magnify. So when I'm looking at my drills, has it got a different one on that side? Let's see. Oops. A little bit wonky. Uh, so that one's not quite so strong. And then it's got a really strong side that shows you. Oh, that's going to be really, really handy. And then a nice little pouch as well. So to me, it's worth it just for that. <laughs> okay. So let's have a look at this little thing. Um, we have got any, oh, it looks like it's going to be picture instructions because it looks like it's all. Oh no, we have got proper instructions. It's a six LED multi, 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 multifunctional magnifier uh, with a power charger. It's got a DP, DC socket, professional lens, hanging rope. Oh, can you hang it around your neck? Oh yeah, you can hang it around your neck. You see that? So she can hang it round your neck. Okay. Oh, same ways. I think you can get something similar for like cross stitch and things. I think she'll hang them round the neck um, so that they can magnify a little bit more. But this one has a little stand. It's got a good long piece of cord. Um, I can imagine, oh, it's a, like elastic as well. It's quite a stretchy so i can imagine that yeah it might get a bit annoying actually but uh, yeah i think you can see there look uh, it is magnifying my scotty dog there let's see if it will magnify this okay oops so yeah it won't be brilliantly clear through there but that's definitely magnifying and as I say, I do believe it lights up. So where's the USB to go into it? That, uh, that's the on and off switch. So we know how to switch it on and off. Oh, there's the AC. 
Now let's see if we can uh, plug it into the USB and have a look. I've just got a USB card down here. So oh, it's not a very long one. That's not going to be very good, is it? Let's see if I can reach the USB card. Oh yes. Oh wow. Okay. So I hope I didn't blind you then. So yes, so it's like a little mini portable. Okay. So yes, yeah, sorry, the cord's not very long and the USB is not brilliant. So when I go on holiday then, rather than taking my whole big magnifying light and all the extension and all the clip to go on the side of my uh, workbench, I can just take this with me. So yeah all right so that's very very handy and we've got the little uh, magnifier with it as well oh that was good then so that was a good purchase that's that one let me just pop that away so hmm, quite impressed with that and it all folds up so it will go in my little box whether i don't i can't imagine i'm gonna have this around my neck really but never say never liz so that's that one. Okay, and that's the instructions. And then finally, this is one of those funny little things that I've actually already got one of these, but um, it's not brilliant. And it isn't the one I got isn't what I expected when I got it. I ought to read things better, shouldn't I? So, as you can see, this one came separately and I've not opened it yet. I've seen a lot of people with these, but this one is a mini Hoover mini cleaner. And again, I got it on special offer, normally £15.79. Now, there's no way I would have paid that price for it, but I got it for £7.89. And the reason I got this one is because it is, oh, oh it's got extras with it. It is a USB one. The original one that I ordered, I did think was um, connected so that you could charge it via USB rather than relying on batteries all the time. So, oh, 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 we've got little filters. So, right, we've got a diamond painting toolkit with this. So, we've got a, a basic pen there with a single placer, a green boat, a little chunk of wax, and they look like quite good bodies. It didn't say anything about having these. I know they'd put it in with diamond painting stuff, but oh, and they're good size bags look nice thick ones as well oh i like those we like little extras so that's those thank you very much so again this was from amazon i will put the link to the actual shop down below looks like this is a <laughs> it's like a little mini sweeping brush if anybody's got um a barbie or uh, a little doll that's she can go sweeping up look or even um, an action man will get the men sweeping up as well <laughs> okay yeah i didn't just want to rely on batteries for everything as, as much as you know i always have batteries i do tend to find that things don't work as well when they start running down so this one is your normal when it's already got a charge in it so you can pick things up with it that's really really good uh, it's the same as like the little hand ones that you know you don't come uh, it's the same as the battery powered ones but as i said i wanted one that was rechargeable um so yeah so that's that but this one also it's got another brush here as well how strange i wonder if that's to go with the diamond painting then rather than a cleaner mm, quite possibly a couple of extras in this then so yeah you've got your power cord there i don't need to charge it up because it's already uh, charged but where does this go then oh yeah just in the side there and it's a fairly standard one so um i've got these all over i've actually bought some labels so that everything is labeled now so that i know which one belongs to which one because i've got them all over but the other reason i liked this one is that it actually has a little spout i guess it goes that way so it just clips in so if you're wanting to get into corners or up to things you've got like a little elephant's trunk <laughs> And you can just go away there and hover up. So yeah, and it's pink as well. I can't resist anything pink. Okay, 
so yeah so i'm quite impressed with that i shall be using that and uh, we've got our little cleaning brush which is in green we've got a green brush so what are these then are these the filters have we got a filter to stop it let's have a look i wonder if these go on here let's see if it says anything about what these are they're just like the little mesh very strange sorry if you can hear talking um i've sneaked upstairs to do a few extra bits of filming because hubby's got some friends from work which is lovely um it's two years unfortunately since he's been able to work um since he had to leave work and uh, yeah his friends still keep in touch which is wonderful and he's just got a couple come to visit him this afternoon so that's great so i thought well i'll leave them to it much as i like seeing them and they know me as well um you know i think it is good for him to have somebody to talk to other than me because <laughs> i only talk about diamond painting of course uh, no it doesn't really say what these are for how odd i suppose you could use it um And then if you start picking diamonds up, I'll have to have a go with that and let you know what I think those are. Um, if you know, let me know in the comments. But yeah, that's um, something a wee bit different. I'll pop that back together, put those in there. And uh, they're very good actually, these for all sorts. I mean, you can use them, you know, particularly using this nozzle, you could use it for cleaning uh, computer keyboards and things. Um, not just strictly for diamond painting but yeah i'm impressed with that and i've paid a good price for it so i'll just put all these bits back into this little bag so i'm not quite sure they do look like sort of filters don't they a mesh filter i don't think your diamonds would go through no they wouldn't hmm. seems to be more diamond painted related oops doesn't want to go in so that's my little hole so i've got a little mini hoover i've got some washi tape i've got some tweezers and i've got a magnifier with an extra magnifier with it okay well i hope you've um, enjoyed seeing these uh, just a few little extra bits as i say i will put all the details down below so if you want to go and explore them yourself and uh, that's me done for now so thanks for stopping by hope to see you all again soon bye for now